Okay, here we go, folks. Basically, it's a Sunday night, 11 6. I'm not sure by the dates. I think this was earlier their shuttle mission earlier this year. But the Chinese got a view of it. I don't know who's possibly seen this earlier. Shows their jet engines here. Hit play, and it'll go into the live shot. I found this tonight. Uh, you could have got a glimpse here a second ago. If you go right to the beginning of the movie, this is being no black folks, and basically one of these guys that subscribed to me just got this footage. Chinese TV, Communist China TV, thirteen, CNTN. Basically, if the cursor goes down, it says basically Blue Planet. Let's see if I can get it to go down on the bottom. There you go, Earth, Sun, Blue Planet. Melanchilolia UFO. I think that might be the guy that's favorited. So there's a satellite feed. I'm tracking their space station or whatever they the probe they put up, rocket, shuttle, whatever. Anyway, that's the planet. If we can trust it, that it wasn't superimposed. Still be no black. Kill a commie for your mommy every day, as far as I'm concerned. Go USA. But anyway. It's getting pretty bad when we have to uh, rely on the communists to be able to see up there because NASA is scared of us to see the truth. So if anybody can translate this stuff, might be of the mission that they had there and everything. Let it play through here. That's a shot of the guys going down on Earth. Uh, I'll speed this up a little bit because I think there's a lot of gap in here. We're just going to see clouds of their shots looking at and then we back to the footage up there. Okay, so this is moving on in the footage later in the video. And I do believe that that's one of their rockets falling off as they're climbing. Okay. And uh, there's a triangulation up there. Is this the dark fuzzy that we end up getting in front of? It looks awful matching to the brightness that we end up in all this year. This whole this year cluster is, matches up to what we end up seeing on our close object fireball network. If you go to the video I had earlier tonight, earlier this afternoon, 11 6, 2011. Now we're going to go back here, play it through one more time. But it just looks exactly what we see up there the triangulation, all of this bam, 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 bam. Triangulation there, triangulation there, and then their stupid sh stuff has ended up covering up some stuff. They have this stuff here. This is part of their shuttle here. This over to here. Let's back that up again. See how far back I can get before those rocket motors. So there's the motors, and then, then we get to this shot. And I'm just not sure if they're using some kind of a double cannon system here. Split shot, sharing a view or something like that out of the same bay, or if this is just a sunshade of some sort. There's the motors again. And here we go. This here's all out in space right here. This, all this. This is their shuttle with the back end of it right here. This is their fringe. This is all mechanical right here. Now I could be wrong and this could be part of the mechanical. This could actually be part of their shuttle right here. But I'm pretty darn sure if you don't let your eyes fool you that everything like right here right along this line here, this up here, that's in space, that's in space, all these objects here are out in space. Boom, 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 triangulation. Back it up a little bit more. You end up, there you go, right 
beginning. Boom, triangulation, and we've seen it down there for a split second. Let me back it up. Right there, we see it. Right there, and then it goes away. Triangulation to flop. Is this our... This stuff was, I believe, early... Early this year. Hey, I'm gonna back that up one more time. Get to the motors and then we went too far back. There you go. All this stuff's out in space. All this. I believe even this year. I believe this is the outline of the back there motor right there. And it almost seems to me like they're trying to cover something up right there. They're trying to cover that up. Which I think it's a tetrahydrin. Right there. Check that out. Right there. That is not part of their space shuttle. That there, folks. Object out in space. Here, here, here. Triangulation there. Triangulation. Got this here. As you can see, they're focusing in and out. And we'll back it up again. You can see that this is part of their shell right here. This here is not. This could be that Oort cloud or another one of the Oort clouds out there. Heck, that could be Ellen and two stones. The very beginning in front of it. Chinese were able to get a closer, better shot than us. See that? The NASA needs to spit out what we've got and try to impress us over what we're getting seen here. Yeah, that or be able to show us and straight out say that this is fake and never be able to back down from it for infinite infinity. So, you can see Space Shuttle, I mean, they're, they're Chinese, sh sh whatever you want to call it, right here, here. But this here, I'm going to freeze it there. I like it planned though. This here and out is all space. This is all space. Corner of their ship is like right here. Let's get that to come back again there. Looks like the corner, if they got anything, it comes out to right somewhere in here. Right about there. Otherwise, all this here, out here, it's all space. That here too, because they try to cover this up. They try to cover this tetrahydrin right here up. As you can see, there it goes. They put that over there, and it ends up covering that tetrahydrin up. We're going to be right at the beginning here. There's that tetrahydrin, and it gets covered up, because this is space out here. Space. Even this here. I'm be really believing that this is that black little cluster that we see in front of this little uncircular sun. That's that dwarf star right there. Dwarf star, dwarf sun right there. And that is the black nanode tail flopper or whatever that we have right there. That ends up being seen down in Palau. My earlier movies. And one about five or six back where the idea that I show you that little black. That's what ends up blocking up coming over the South Pole. And you even seen it in my video earlier this afternoon, 11-6-2011. that flopper and it goes away triangulation triangulation probably with here right there there and like I say they put that blue there and it covers up this tetrahydrin right there and it might be the triangulation there there and there so there's stuff out there folks and this is earth down here ladies and gentlemen folks y'all that is Earth down there. But an interesting thing is to figure out when this was taken. So, there you go. And then I'll speed it up and we'll go look at the tailwind portion again.
which where it starts again at the end, and that looks like the what to me I got one more time that that it looks like a rocket. At the very end of this here, you're going to see it looks like they're showing one of their rockets going away from the ship when they were going up. Right there, either that or I'm going to freeze that. Okay, here we go. Either that or they are zooming in on one of that tetrahydrin that possibly they put the blue. So interesting, folks. If you can figure out these dates, uh, the positioning, they're saying that the lab was here when it took the shot. More than likely, this objects were back here behind. Okay, so they're basically illustrating what they're shooting. This looks like the Korean Peninsula. And again, it'll be here in a, in a minute here. There was that flopper again. Let's get, get freeze out again. Okay, here we go. We're going to have this flopper. Uh, I guess that's the satellite feed, okay? But the idea, you can see, now there was a flopper. It comes across. Check this. That comes across. It goes boom, boom, boom. There it comes. Bam, bam, bam. Watch it. It's going to go boom, boom, boom. Across the screen. Boom, boom, boom. Across the screen. There it comes. Boom, boom, boom. Now, we're going to freeze that. Here we go. Okay, we're going to get some pictures of that. Okay, so this is over the Korean Peninsula, and again in a second we're going to get a view. And here comes that flopper. I believe this is where it's at. I had to come out across in a minute. But there they are over the Korean Peninsula. The southeastern part of the peninsula. And as you can see the live the, you know that that time the live shot up over here too to the left. Speed it up because the clouds are kinda of boring. There's really nothing to see there. Scoot it up. We're at twelve minutes. Is this where we get the flopper again? Okay, hang on. That's where I want to keep catching. This idea is, did they lose? Did they just get into focus with the object here? Let it play. Trying to freeze it. You see, what's, what's tough is it seems like when I try to freeze it coming around the second playback, not able to catch that early glimpse. Yeah. So if you, oh there it is. So is that the rocket going away from the ship? Or is this a tetrahydron? Right there. Either that or they have a picture, they're getting a picture of either one of their satellites or one of our satellites right there. And that's what it, that really does look like to me. It looks like one of our satellites, somebody's satellites, some country's satellites, or the one a picture of their satellite. It really looks like one of our satellites. So there they are, spying in space as they are doing so scientific. But anyway, everybody gets some pictures up there. And then moving away. So that looks like a satellite moving away. But then again, it could be a tetrahydron. So now, is this the sun or that dwarf star? And let's see. So I'm do, we'll play it here. But so you can see that this is either the sun or a dwarf star and satellite or tetrahydron right there. And as that moves away, then comes this, then comes that, and then they go farther back. So, what's interesting is, do they, is the camera zoomed in on this shot? There it is. As you can see it as I froze it. Let's watch this as it moves away. I'll try to see if I can freeze it again. And then they focus there, they're in on it. So here's a close shot, folks. Is that a tetrahydron below it? And this is a really zoomed in shot, it looks like, with the camera. And then it looks like they zoom out. So is this triangulation? Boom. And another one here. And let's play it and move out. Stunning. It looks like they are actually zoomed in and zoomed out on this tetrahydron action here. That they had a close shot of this. So there's your stuff, folks. Legal disclaimer.